Orlando, Kimbra. Orlando. Yes. Okay. Get into the middle. Move over a little bit more. Orlando. Other way. There we go. I'm trying to make sure you don't get the light in the background. Yeah, I see. Okay. Orlando, how old are you, sir? 54. 54. Where are you calling us from? Chicago. Well, actually, Olympia Fields. Okay, so... Okay, I'll say Olympia. Can I still say Chicago? Chicago. All right. What's your zodiac sign? Cancer. Cancer. You have any kids? I have four children. How old are your four kids? My oldest is 32. I have two twin daughters that are 28. Wait for it. I got a five-year-old too. Okay. Why are you not with how many women? Uh, my oldest three are with my ex-wife. Why are you not with the five-year-old mom? Uh, that was just some thing that happened after I got a divorce. Ooh. It was short-lived. Short-lived. Okay. What do you do for a living, Orlando? Real estate investor. Real estate investor. All right. Um, I think they like you, Orlando. <laughs> we got Orlando, 54 cancer, real estate investor, lives in Chicago, dad of four kids, three by his ex-wife, and then one after he got divorced. Correct. Okay. What kind of woman are you looking for now? Whew. Um, really, I'm just looking for somebody that's really real, um, all about really trying to build together. Um, I've actually built a nice um, nice setting for myself. I mean, I, I work hard. I've worked hard. Now I work smart. I don't work hard anymore. But uh, just somebody that's willing to get to know um, somebody that is not selfish, uh, somebody that wants, I like uh, people that are optimistic, people that are ambitious. Um, so I'm looking for somebody like that. Okay. What are your deal breakers? Uh, I, I would like for somebody to, that is, um, I'm looking for somebody that that wants to have things in life, right? Um, you know, I know sometimes women don't like to say what they bring to the table, right? Sometimes that upsets people, um, but I would, they don't have to match me, but at least have something going on for yourself, right? Okay. So should she look a certain way? Um, of course I love somebody that's beautiful, but I also want somebody that's smart, that has brains, that's, Somebody that, that is accomplished or wants to try to accomplish things in life. I actually did should the woman look a certain way. You did. I mean, I'm looking for beautiful women, but I'm also looking for beautiful women from the inside out as well. You know, okay. so it's not always about the outward appearance. It's about what's inside. Okay. What about money? Should she make a certain amount of money? As long as she can kind of take care of herself and her, her needs, I'm good. I mean, I can take care of myself and probably a lot of other people, but, uh, uh, but I'm looking for somebody that's self-sufficient. Okay. Now, um, what are the comments saying? No, I don't know. Oh, oh, they're not okay. saying anything. I was looking who's in the back room. Um, let's do the Kendra cam. Let's do the Kendra cam. Well, they probably are saying, but I wasn't reading in that moment. I was, okay. I was actually looking at the back room. All right. We got to see your legs. Oh, we on television. You got to, that's us on the TV screen in the back. Yeah. <laughs> Set this up. Go in the middle, Orlando. Okay. All right, we got you, boo. All right. We got you, baby. So, Orlando, am I saying it right? Orlando? Orlando. Orlando. Yeah. Orlando, do you want the woman to be in Olympia Field, Chicago area? Uh, Not necessarily, no. Okay. What's the age range you want to date? You're 54. Um, I probably maybe, uh, I'm looking for somebody that's mature. So maturity doesn't really necessarily have a, a age on it, but I would probably say maybe 10 to 15 years younger than me, or as, as I'd say as old as 54, but maybe 10 to 15 years younger. So you want either 40, like 49. So it would I mean, be, excuse me, 39, 39, 39. Yes. 39 and up. You want 39 and up, 39 and up. Do you want more kids? That depends on the person that I'm with, if they want like kids. 
I mean, if I know it's going to be something that's going to be long lasting, I wouldn't have a problem with having kids. Could you have kids already? Sure. Okay. So Rolando, 54, cancer. When was your last relationship? Ooh, like three years ago. Okay, three years ago. Was that your child's mom? No. Oh, different one. Okay. Um, you don't have to answer, but I'm going to ask. When's the last time you was intimate with someone? Uh, I'm going to pass. Okay. Three flaws you have to work on. Um, being stubborn is one. Um, being able to have the ability to be, you know, as we get older, we're not as flexible. So maybe trying to be a little bit more flexible. And I need to get back into the gym. <laughs> okay. And why would a woman be lucky to be with you? Why would she be lucky to be with me? Yes. I'll say this. I have everything that a man could ask for. I'm missing one thing. That's a special somebody. Woo! I got the cars. I got the homes. All of that stuff, right? But I'm looking for somebody that's genuine that wants to love me for me. I was to say, I feel like, so you feel like that's difficult to find? It has been. I, I've been seriously looking for three years since I moved into this house. It seemed like when I lived in the western suburbs, I had more success but it was always the women in the South suburbs that I was getting. Now that I've moved out to the South suburbs, it's like, I don't really get anybody. And I'm like, what's going on? So what's been your challenge? Um, I, I think sometimes it's success. Um, I think a lot of times when people meet me and then they, they see my, I live a very basic lifestyle, but I have a very nice home. Matter of fact, I know you used to be out here, but, I live in a house that used to belong to a former member of Destiny's Child. Um, R. Kelly's old house is like literally right across from where I live at right now. Okay, so you live, you're talking about Michelle Williams? Yes. Okay, okay. <laughs> you um, knew that, right? I mean, I, Michelle, people know, if you don't know, Michelle's from the Chicagoland area. Right. Uh, but, and you live across from R. Kelly's old house. Correct. So you, you live in a nice house. I do. Okay, and now I just want a woman to fill it with. So I have a house, but I'm looking for a woman to help me make it a home. Woo! Talking that talk. He's talking that talk. All right, well, listen, I, you mentioned you was on the app. I found you while you were looking. This yep. is you, correct? That is me, Kendra. All yeah. right, smooth operator. <laughs> Lando54, L-A-D-O. 54 is his username, and you can find him. Okay, let's go to some more pictures. Okay. He said he got a house, but he needs a woman to make it a home. Stop playing with him. 39 and up, he said. 39 and up. Okay. Here we go. Here we go. And this is his username, ladies. Lando Kimbarg. Kimbro. Orlando Kimbro. Kimbro. But put in the username. You can type anything, you'll find him. L A N D O 5 4. All right, they say you a sugar daddy. Not no sugar daddy. That listen, all that right there. That's what it seemed to be. You know, people like, oh, I'm trying to get the bag. I want the bag. Well, I got the bag, baby, but I'm not gonna spend it on you, right? Like, what you want to do together? I'm not a sugar daddy, no. Well, you know, you want you want younger, so you might I, have to be a sugar daddy for some of the younger girls, though. Listen, what I, the empire that I built, I'm just not gonna give it away, Kendra. It's not, it's not that like that. I understand. I understand. But if you want younger, you know, the younger go to make sure the money right. Because why else would the younger go older? Uh, some of them go older because they're more mature. And I hear a lot of times they say that the men that they date around their age are not as mature. Okay. Right. Well, let's see what it do. We done put you on the World Wide Web now. All right, so We done increased the chances for all the women. I'm going to make you a highlight. So you get all the love, all the all the people coming okay. your way. So it's um, if she's not in the Chicago area, she has to be willing to relocate, right? Yeah, I'm flexible on that. I can travel. I mean, I, I my schedule is pretty flexible. I can do kind of. Well, the only reason I said that is because you talked about this house that, that you're in, and you want someone to make it a home. So wouldn't she have to relocate if she doesn't live there? Oh well, eventually, yeah. If we make a connection, I would love for that. But I, I'm open to possibly relocating myself, maybe going somewhere south. Okay, okay. So you, uh, you know, Chicago gets cold here, Kendra. That, that's one of the reasons why, why you left, that's right? Why I live in Cali 
And that's why I live in California. <laughs> that's exactly why I live. I moved from Chicago a year and a half ago. It would be almost, yeah, a year and a half ago. And that's why my black ass moved. <laughs> I know. I was like, Kendra, Kendra don't live in uh, Chicago. Hell no, oh. she sure don't. She do not live in no Illinois no more. <laughs> yeah, these winters be brutal out here, but la the last few years has been not so bad, but still, yeah. it's Chicago. It's Chicago. Yeah, shout out to Chicago. I would not be who I am without that city. But right. child, after eight years of those winters, I deserved a summertime for a while but let's yeah. back to you it's orlando how am i saying it right Arla so it's like orlando just orlando with an a orlando okay Kim Arla bro. i'm a bro okay Kim bro okay orlando he works Kim in bro. real estate he's a real estate investor 54 cancer chicago land area olympia fields where he lives dad of four kids three by his ex-wife oh do you want to get married again i love to get married i, I, I saw my that. mom and dad they were together for 58 years until my dad passed away in April. And the way I'm looking for somebody to love me the way my mom loved my dad. And okay. when I saw that, that love story is probably the most beautiful story I've ever seen in my life. Okay. And he has a five-year-old. He has a five-year-old. All right, here we go. Here we go right there. All right. Um, this is fine, girls. Okay, what does it say? Uh, all right. I literally paid a girl's rent this month and Jews like you. Wait, let me see what this says. Let's see Go what, ahead. This, what Kentrell said. I literally pay my girls rent this month. Then there's do then there's dudes like you. I'm flying girls to Paris for the first date. Then there's you. Stop being so cheap. I don't believe he's being true. <laughs> hey, I can't tell him how to spend his money, Kendra. He spent hey, he made that money. Spend your money, right? Yeah, he says, spend your money how you want to spend your money. He right. said, I think you answered this already, though. How and where did you meet the five-year-old's mom? Were you in a relationship with her? No, I was not in a... Yeah, it's, it's a little complicated, but I'll give you a short version. So we were in an entanglement. We were not in a relationship. I thought we were moving that way, but she was dating several other men when I, when I met her, and I found out she was dating other guys. Um, and then... She had a baby by me because she thought I was going to marry her. She had this thing in her arm and had it taken out. And so now I'm a single parent dad. She had a what in her arm? You know, the thing that stops you from getting pregnant. Oh, and she took it out. Yes. So do you have custody or share custody? Uh, neither one of us has custody, but my child lives here with me. Why would I need custody when my son bears my last name? Well, I guess I'm asking who does, I guess in other words, I was asking where does the child live primarily? He lives here with me. Okay. Monday Monday through Friday, he's with me. On the weekends, he's with his mom. Okay. So, okay. That's something else a woman has to be open to is that your child, your five-year-old child lives with you. Correct. Okay. All right. Well, listen, thank you for that question. We almost would have skipped over all that information. Right. All right. Well, I put them out there, ladies. If you want them, go get them on the Kendra G Singles dating app. That's how you can find them. Smooth operator. That's a Chicago outfit right there. Chicago. <laughs> All right, keep me posted how it goes, love. Okay, Kendra. All right, bye, babe. Kendra G Singles, the dating app is available now on your iPhone and your Android phones. Just go to your Apple Store or your Google Play Store and download it now. Kendra G Singles, the dating app.